What is up, people? Welcome back to another episode of FTB Continuum. I hope everybody's doing all right. I'm doing pretty good. And I've actually done a couple of things. Uh, I've removed the drawers over there, so if we want to manually do something, well, we, we've got to place it on there ourselves. Uh, I've added this thing here. I didn't want to autom like uh, show it to you guys how I made this. It's quite easy. Just like in the back, there's like transfer nodes, there's a chest that goes into the smelter, bees, stuff, and then it come out. It, it's actually quite quick. I can show you with uh, some wood to turn into, uh, let's like get two stacks. And you're going to see it's, it's quite quick. Uh, I could make it even quicker by adding better upgrades in there. Uh, because what's actually slow is the uh, is the grabbing of the items and not the items itself. So as you can see, two stacks, it's soon going to be finished. So I could also add more flowers, but it's already done. So if I was to add more flowers, it would go actually even faster. So maybe eventually I'll add like another row of flowers above. That could be a thing, and that would be even faster. But uh, to be honest, this this is quick enough. So I, I just thought that uh, we're we're gonna need space on this wall. We we've got four left. That's it. That's the space we got. I might need to go a little bit further. Uh, I still got the lag when I get into here, but then it goes. It's chunk update, so I don't know what could cause this chunk update. And if you can look at the bottom, the green line, you can see like when it goes up and down. This is when chunk updates happen, pretty much. If you look, Cloud got 20, and now it's gone back to zero, but I just got a peak again. I got 16, and now it's gone back to zero. So I don't know what's causing the chunk updates. Uh, I know that it's somewhere around here because it barely happens. Well, I say this and. Well, it kind of happens here, but it's more constant, so you don't really notice the change. So yeah, here it's more constant, but if we look that way, and we go that way, we're gonna see it goes down really low, and then there's like the bump that we keep having. So it's something around here, I presume, but uh, I still haven't pinpointed where it is. So, what do we want to do today? Well, today we want to work a little bit on our things to get to space, and we've got other things we want to do. Like, of course, getting a freaking backpack, because I'm tired of having my inventory filled up with items that don't really need to be there. And I think it would be a better idea if we had the backpacks. So, there's a couple of bags. You can do the bag like this, the bag of a holding. But I'm going to go for a backpack because we've got the basic backpack and these kind of things with the upgrades that you can put on it. And this thing's a lot better. Oh yeah, it's true. We need to make this. Oh wait, you need pressed wax? Really? <laughs> I did not know this. Uh, is there cranberries? Do I have cranberries? No, cran... I've got cranberries, but I don't have cranberries. Uh, there's the presser, which you can do the honeycomb. Okay. Uh, and the honeycomb comes from the apiaries. Can we make the apiary? Oh, of course. What? Okay, well, let's do this one. Alright, and bam. Okay, let's make one apiary. Alright, and this thing's going to need a bee. Do I have a bee for that mod? I do! I do, I do have a bee. I believe it does need to have grass. So maybe we should go to our uh, our bee area where we had one at first. Let's put that in there. Uh, and this should do the trick. Maybe we can speed it up with the bee gun? Well, let's see if it works on this thing. Thirty-seven. So I'm not sure. Still at 37. Well, let's leave it uh, working. And we're just going to continue doing other things instead. Uh, but that means we can't do the, gu the, 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 the bag right now unless we, we try to find cranberries. Uh, what, what was the other one? Yeah, one cranberry. <laughs> There's a machine with nothing in it. Alright. 
Laxcomb, 50% chance. Yeah, we, we could try to find cranberries. Because they do have... I believe I have it at the bottom. I may have moved it. But let's go check it out. Uh, yeah, I think I broke it. Yeah, there's no more anything in here. Wait, did I? Did I kill this guy? I don't know why he's no longer there. But all right. So let's go back here. Let's go back up. So I even added the recipe for the intricate circuit, the, the best one over here. And like it, it crafts like a charm. I've got no issue whatsoever. And of course I needed to have like the smelting for these. And of course a couple of recipes over here. But mainly things are going like quite nicely. I should probably have like the storage. But eh, it's not something really uh, that uh, important. But alright, le let's look what we need. We need the space stuff. So let's do space. And let's see, can we craft that? Yes we can. Alright, can we craft that? Yes, we can. Can we craft that? I doubt we can craft that. All right, let's do this. This one here. Let's do this. Bam. All right. Oh, and that's the legging. <laughs> so there you go. We've got the suited up. I believe it's a quest. Oh, there's another thing. Suit workstation. Okay. Uh, suit workstation. There we go. Woohoo! New uniform. That's pretty cool. Uh, I kind of wanted to do something. I am probably going to build it off camera or maybe do the time lapse that I normally do if I can make the work, the, the, the mod work. But I wanted to make a platform here over the water where we're going to have like uh, the, the thing like this and uh, like the launch pads for for our space things all the way over here and it would be like you know a different color because it's space station stuff but uh, for the moment i don't know if this thing needs power uh so you can paste a p place a piece and i presume you can put upgrades so let's do advanced oh, advanced so i presume there's like uh, upgrades you can put in those tank rocket fuel Oh yeah, you can put the, the tanks here. So I presume you don't put rocket fuel in there, you, you put oxygens. So there's going to be machines that we need to make again. So what we're going to do for the moment is we're going to go back down. We're going to grab ourselves a uh, armor stand. Uh, this one. And of course I don't have slabs. There we go. Armor stand. We're going to place that at the top. Probably over here. It looks like a great place to place this. Alright. And we're going to put that on there. That one on here. Bam. That looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool. We've got one there for bees and one there for space. That's awesome. So let's look at the other things we need to do. Is there like an actual... No, there, there's nothing you get from there. Okay, we need to make the electrolyzer. That's where we're at. There's also the look at me beacon. But I, there, there's no one else on the server, so we're not going to do that. Uh, so, alright, electrolyzer. Oh, wait, it, it does tell you everything you need. So, two power input. Let, let's do the electrolyzer block. Electro... Laser, I presume it's this one. Perfect, let's see what we need. Okay, we just need the three normal ones that we always need, pretty much. For making these machines, but I never know how many I'm gonna need, so I don't make that many. Perfect, and there we go, that is the electrolyzer. So, now let's see, machine... We've got 30, so let's grab 15. Uh, we need two, but, you know, I got 15. Fluid input one, power input, fluid output. And electrolyzer. Okay, so fluid. Do we have anything? No. So fluid. Uh, rocket fluid? No. There we go. Fluid input. That was one. We need a bucket. Uh, I guess craft 20. Bucket. Should come quite quickly. 
Wow, that was a really great sentence. It should come quite quickly. It's a tongue twister that is quite easy, though. All right. And then the other things we need, oh, is the output. Just going to need a bucket under, but we need two of these. All right. We, we also need the power. That president is going to be there. Power input, one and two. All right. And let's do that one. Bam. Will it work? There we go. All right. We still need the coil because I don't think I made any coil. And of course, we're going for the, the best one, which is the iridium coil. So two iridium coil. All right. We, oh, that was one, but sure. Oh, and let's look at the assembler. Uh, assembler, I presume? No, it's not the assembler. What is the name? The hollow projector. Hollow. Or is it hollow? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna place this machine on this side. All right, hollow projector. We are in need of the electrolyzer. Would you please give me the electrolyzer? Is there, yes, there is one above. All right, so we're, we're just gonna put that uh, one block further back. Perfect. So let's get our thing fluid output over here, fluid output over here. I presume the one in the back is the fluid input. I kind of don't like this. It's not constant where things go. Uh, this is the power, the coil goes above, so let's place the coil. Place the electrolyzer in front. Uh, this is the machine frame you need. Uh, with this one here. And let's put these two bad boys over there. That, that, that's a good looking thing. Alright, so how does it work? Well, you input your liquid from the back, which of course you can't access from the top. All right. And then it's going to give you what you need from the other side. That's pretty cool. Oh, nice. Uh, no, I, oh, I was looking at the wrong quest. I thought it was giving me uh, some stuff that was actually useful. I, I could eat that, but... No, I'm going to get them back because this thing is open. <laughs> yeah, let, let's see. Uh, did, did we get one? Oh, we got two with a bee grub. All right, so we got these two, so we can use them in the presser. But uh, we'll we'll need more because, well, I think we need like four. So, all right, next one. What do we need? We need the rocket fuel. Oh, this one's a little bit bigger. So we need a motor, a motor, motor, fluid output, output, two fluid input, one input hatch. Two output and a chemical reactor. So let's do chemical reactor. Okay, this is probably like the other ones where we need three of them. No, we need to make gold plates. Gold plates. What? I don't have gold plates as a crafting recipe? Probably because I don't have... Wait, where are all the... IE plates. Oh, I'm only using it for this. Okay, well, uh, just just because it's actually faster, we're we're gonna go with the one at the top. <laughs> I do need to automate these. They will be automated. Don't worry about this. It is not something that I want to just go on and uh, not automate. Uh, I, sometimes I hate this thing. It's like you need to start it over. I don't know why. Is it because? No, it's in one chunk. So, I'm really not sure why it's doing this. It might be something I should report. Uh, Alright. 64, perfect. And now the three usual suspect we need to make. Uh, this one. That one. And of course, uh, that one over here. Uh, there we go. Oh wait, we, we are still missing that one. Is it a new one? No, the gold one was a new one. But there we have it, we've got this one here. So, 
output. Uh, we need one output. We need one fluid output. Now input. Um, I don't remember. Well, it's one out, one input, two input fluid. So two input like these, and one input. Perfect. We need one machine power, as well. We need two of these. It was good that I made a bunch of small batteries. I didn't think about this, but uh, okay. And we need the motor. So motor. Of course, we go for the one that gives the most. Can we just make it? No, we cannot. One, two. And these, there we go. And there we go. So there we go, we got the quest. Perfect. So let's place it next to the one that we already have. And the one we are looking for is the chemical reactor. I don't know if it's gonna be any bigger, so let's try it here first. No, it seems to be, it seems to be one block bigger, that's it. So are they aligned together? Well, this one's a line. So I guess th this one should be... Well, this one should be one block closer. So we're gonna leave this one here. All right, so we're gonna put that up there. Fluid input, where are you at? Fluid input. It's cool that you can place it in the air. Okay, we got the input hatch. Presume it's the one in the back. Input hatch. Uh, output fluid, fluid output. To the right. Output hatch here. A one machine structure. Two power input over here. And the chemical reactor up top. Ooh. All looking great. It's just it's just I find weird that like these blocks don't change. But like everything else changes. So I don't know. It's just the way I see it. I find this a little bit strange. All right, so we did this one. There's no, uh, nothing to give us. Metallum X Vacu I6. Seriously, it depends on this. We've done that one. We know we've done that one. So I might just like give me the quest because I'm not going to recraft everything. This is the one for the ore miner six. So if if we look, I do have the ones from before, which was uh, this one here. So the void ore miner. But when I tried to do this one, it was there was an issue with it. So like I said, I think I'm going to simply give myself the quest as we've done it already. And the, the way you do that, there's a command for this, uh, but you need to be an admin for that. But yeah, so you can see my tier six. So uh, let me uh, find the commands to give me that quest. And we're going to be able to continue because I, I need to know what I'm doing here because I've never done act like anything about space. So let me find what I need to find. Okay, guys, so uh, check it out. So I gave myself the four quests. It's not that hard. It's just like BQ admin complete and the number of the quest. And if you look at every quest like these, there's a number next to the quest. So you just complete a quest like this. Uh, but yeah, since I completed these when we were testing, there was still some issues. So, all right. Well, uh, I never actually claimed them because, well, I couldn't. It was impossible. <laughs> and there we go. So now we get four chests. Maybe it's going to give me... It's actually stuff that could be used. So I won't complain. It's better than food. <laughs> so, all right. Uh, pretty much now, like I said, this thing is now open. You need launch pad, three structure tower, and there's a bunch of text there that you can read. And there's the stuff like liquid fuel, the guidance computer, the seat, the liquid fueled engine. So there's a bunch of things. There's also the rocket assembly machine. There's the fueling station, the linker, the planet chip ID. There's a bunch of things you need to do. But first, let's make this machine, which we don't have much for it. But uh, we can do it. I presume we should have everything. Uh, one, two. Oh, wow. We're running out of this thing. Okay, we're going to need to make some. How did I get this? Oh, maybe I clicked it here. 
Oh wait, we we need two steel plate steel. Let's grab a stack. I hope I can do it here. I don't know if I can. Oh, I keep clicking there. I seem to be able to. Perfect. There we go. 64. Alright, let's put, put these two there. So I presume this thing's going to uh, g give me stuff when I have this. So I don't know how it works. Okay, so you put your gas and then you put your items, you're gonna fill it up. Uh, it also gives you, oh, quest, Final Frontier. This, a tank of oxygen. So uh, let's put, what? Uh, oh, what? <laughs> I placed my tank in there and it came out as a bucket. Hmm. I think this is something we should report. Well, let me take a screenshot of this just to remember. <laughs> well, I had a tank of oxygen. I no longer have one. But all right, uh, let, let's see if we can make that backpack because like I said, I'm tired of having all the things in my inventory and it is quite important. There we go, we got four. Let's go to the presser. Um, I, I don't know if I got it back here. Presser, perfect. Okay, can I speed it up? Yes, you can. Oh, and that gave me enough. Oh, I didn't know. It gives us two. And yeah, there we go. Perfecto. All right, this thing. Can you give me some of that? One, two, three, four. Oops, I did five because I had a tiny lag. All right, basic backpack. Um. Yeah, that, that thing's cheaper, but we still need to make... I kind of hate that the recipe says you need to do this because you need to do that instead. So, yeah. Alright, so let's do this one. Bam. We're going to make a couple of you anyway. I'm making like 32. There we go. Alright, so one of these. Dude, get in there. Dude, get in there. Perfect. Oh yeah, and of course I'm never going to go to the bag of holding. Uh, j just so you know, this is the size of this bag, which is pretty much the size of the bag of holding. But this bag, the difference is you can actually, I think, put it into your self and you don't need to have it laying around your inventory. So, where is that bag? Open block, more overlays, mine together. Iron backpack. So normally I do these two. Uh, what is being used by semicolon? Semicolon. Uh, you're going to go to period, to comma, to slash, to bracket, to numpad 7. Wow, numpad 7 is used. There you go, numpad 8. Done. So yeah, when you're going to click... Uh, wait... Can I not equip it? Oh, you can't equip it. Maybe they blocked it. Oh man. Oh, disabled. Dang it. Reset. Well, I guess our numpad 8 can go back to semicolon. Well, what is even better, you can have it in your inventory, you press a key and it's open. You don't need to have it in your hand and right click in it. Uh, maybe you can put it in... You can put it in your oven, of course. But, alright. So, this is pretty much the bag. But if we look backpack, uh, there's a couple of upgrades you can make. Everlasting upgrades. I don't know what that's for. Uh, we can't craft it, so. Alright, this thing. Extra upgrade points. To add upgrade points, you can lock it. You can add damage bar to visually represent how full the backpack is. And that's pretty much it. I thought there was more than that. I might have removed... There was a mining one, there was like a couple of ones. But, alright, so that means I can click the key and do, you can go in there, 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 and there we have it! Oh wait, 
Uh, I forgot one. You can go in there. Perfect. My inventory. Oh, wait. One, one more. You can go in there. There we have it. And also in there. Oh, yeah. They removed the nested upgrade. You could before put bags in bags. And it seems they removed it. So that is a sad thing. A sad, sad thing. Okay, so let's look here. What can we do? Launch pad. Let's see, can we make that? Launch pads. I'm not going to place any of those. Well, it would be better, better if I'm in there. Okay, so I don't have concrete. Uh, water. Yeah, that, that's easy to do. So let's, let's try to go there again. Wow, there's like crazy 13 recipes. There we go. There we go. Perfect. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, seven, eight. Perfect. And we're going to keep this because I think it's the same material. Okay. So we got the launch pad. We need structure tower. Structure towers. I mean, like so. Bam. You need three. Detect. Okay. Next one. Liquid fuel tank. Liquid fueler. Fueled engine. Guidance computer. So let's do a liquid. There's the liquid fuel tank. And this is titanium steel. Eh, quite actually, quite easy to me. I thought it would be complicated. Guidance computer. Guidance. Whoa. Tracking circuit. All right, all right. That's nice. We need to use our, uh, our machine. So we need basic circuit. I have ender redstone. Redstone. I have ender. And circuit, I do have some, that's good. And how many will that make? That makes one for one. Do we need to have more of this one? Rocket unloader? Yeah, we're, we're going to need a couple of those. So let's make eight, because we can. Uh, wait, is that the machine? Precision assembler, this one. Input is right here. So let's do eight. One, two, three, four, back, back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I clicked, but it didn't go in there. Oh, that, that might be a bug. <laughs> look, look, check this out. Shift click. It went there instead. Huh. That's weird. Really, really weird. Uh, I still haven't made that stupid, stupid uh, rain stuff. But all right, let's do this. There we go. Guidance. Oh, we need a seat. Uh, no, seat. Perfect. Complete. All right. And then rocket assembly machine. A rocket assembly machine. Oh, wow. We, 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 we need a couple of things. You, titanium. I, I would think I, I'd have, like, the gear stuff made. Metal press. Okay. Uh, I, I've got one more spot, so let's go. Let's go make one, so we can make more. All right. Um, which one is the gear? I think the gear is the one in the middle. Oh, it's the one on the side. So there we go. There we go, one gear, perfect. Let's add that to our recipe. And then that one's pretty much full because I don't think I can make more. I'm gonna have to add another chest if I do this. All right, so let's do... Oh, I need to make more patterns, of course. Here we go, 40. It should be enough. Pattern. Give me what you have. All right, so one, two, three, four of these. Gear will give you one of these. Perfect. Now let's put that one in there. And now we still need these three things that we always need. A rocket assembly. Detect. Okay. Fueling station linker. 
fueling station. Okay. Doable. Bam. Wow, that that's easy to make. Fuel station and the linker. Wow, another recipe quite easy to make. All right, done. Next, planet ID chip. How do you make that thing? Okay, so you need to satellite so we can make that. And then we can make that. And quest complete. We have a liftoff. We, we don't really have a liftoff. I will have to read all of this on the side because, like I said, I am a newbie when it comes to advanced rocketry. And I do need it in between episodes, or maybe, maybe at the beginning of next episode. I will be crafting, or more, building the platform that's going to be here. So, guys, that is going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you loved it, don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.